Hey everybody, Joy here. Joy still sounding really awful. <laughs> I sound, at first I sounded like I had a deep, deep, deep frog voice. Now I sound like Tinkerbell. <laughs> ah, I had to say hi, I had to say hello. You're gonna think that I'm not here anymore and I am still here. I've been trying to do my devotions because you know they're just five minutes long. So I can usually get through those, but I warn you, when I talk, I start coughing. Went to my doctor yesterday, or was it the day before? It was the day before. And so I've had three days of an antibiotic now. I had a shot in my behind, some kind of steroid. And she took an x-ray of my chest, which is fine, nothing wrong with my chest, it's just a cold or the flu or whatever y'all call it and I know a whole bunch of people out there are having it besides me so I know how you feel <laughs> I woke up this morning feeling the best I felt I started get started this a week ago Thursday what's today you didn't tell us the date joy last Thursday this is Friday a week later I woke up with no voice and so that's how it started. And then the pressure in the head and the horrible, horrible headache and the stuffy, stuffy nose and the can't sleep and the super sore throat and all of that. And so by the time my doctor got back from vacation and I got into Seer, it had all dropped into my chest. So that's where it is now. So God is working in my lungs to make them all better. I'm absolutely positive about it. So, what have I been doing? I got my Christmas trees quilted. I know they're upside down or sideways for you, but you still can see the pattern. The pattern is called Let It Snow, the quilting pattern on top. And I used, I used this really pretty silver thread. It's a fairly new brand from when I've used metallic threads. Um, I heard about it first from Becky Thompson over there at Power Tools with Thread. And I think it has been around a while, but I'm just hearing about it. So, it is called King Star. King Star, and this is silver. And it is everything they say it is. It sews like an absolute dream. It sews better than regular thread, if you can believe it. It's just unbelievable. Years ago when I used um, metallic thread for embroidery, <sighs> It broke and 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 the back side looked horrible and oh my gosh. When you use metallic on the top, you use regular thread on the back. Don't put metallic on top of metallic in case anybody cares. So this silver thread is what's on here. I was so worried that it would not show up on the white. But it turns out it shows up great on the white and you can't see it at all on the green trees. <laughs> so go figure. So I am up to the binding stage. I put a hanging sleeve on the back, on the top. Hanging sleeve right here. And usually they're twice that wide. I never use half the width in them, so I made this one a lot narrower. This isn't going to any quilt show anywhere, so what's it need to be four inches wide for? It's probably two and a half inches. So yesterday I sewed the binding all the way around and so now it's got to be turned to the back side and whip stitched. I'm going to do it by hand because I need to sit and I need to quit being so active because I get up in the morning thinking oh yeah I feel so good and I just hit the ground running and a couple hours later I'm like why am I so tired? <laughs> it's like you poked a, a pin in a balloon. <laughs> It just drains out. So I'm going to sit. I've already got my needle and my thread and my pincushion and my scissors and everything downstairs. So I'm going to sit in a comfy chair and I'm going to watch some old movie on TV that Jerry would never watch. Maybe a Christmas movie. <laughs> Let me see. What are the Christmas movies? It's a Wonderful Life. Is that the one with James Stewart and Donna Reed? Um, I always want to watch it. Jerry never. I don't want to watch that. I don't want to watch that. I think I'll just watch it by myself and he can go do whatever he wants to do. Huh? Sometimes you gotta watch a movie alone, don't you think? So I wanted to tell you, I started out thinking that this was going to be an awesome binding. I thought I am going to use this for the binding because it's got the black and the red and the green 
and I think it will look amazing. And so I had it all pinned all around. Probably can't see it out of the light. And so I had it all pinned all around. This was hanging up here just like it is now. And Jerry came up and I said, look, 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 look at the binding I'm going to put on my quilt. And he said, you need to do it green, Joy. <laughs> so I just happened to have a thousand strips of green. <laughs> so I just started sewing my two and a half inch strips together. And so now the edges are all going to be patchwork. The binding is going to be patchwork like the front. The only trick was, and it happened one time, it has many, many diagonal seams in it. Many. At least a dozen. And you have to be sure that you don't end up with one of those seams on the corner. And it happened one time. So I just cut and re it together and made sure the seam didn't end on the corner. So I love it. I can't wait to get it up on the wall. So I need to quit talking to you. I have Avandra texted me yesterday and she said, What projects do you have to work on? <laughs> I'll show you. <coughs> Sorry, cough break there. Let me turn the camera around and I'll show you the projects I have left to work on. Check it out. I've got the Blue Barn quilt. I've got the Safe Harbor quilt. I've got the Fall Carpenter Star Wheel quilt. I've got the Tree quilt, which is almost done. I've got the Kitty quilt for Viv that I can't wait to get back to. That's my favorite one. The Butterfly quilt, which is a huge, huge applique project. Uh, by Darcy um, Darcy Ashton. She lives in Oklahoma City and she does all kinds of animals. She's the one that did the owls. And then what's that other one? The mystery quilt by Edita Sitar. That's how many quilts I have going right now. This shows you that I have no life <laughs> other than what goes on up here in this room. <laughs> yeah, no life. <laughs> I'm walking all over the black binding. Yes. I go nowhere. I do nothing. I have no friends here. I have Terry, but she doesn't have time for me. She doesn't have time for anything. Her family's humongous. I've told you that before. She and her husband have seven kids between them, and then they all have kids. and So she's busy, 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 busy all the time. So I hardly ever get to even see Terry, never mind go someplace with her. So I, wanna, I prayed for Terry, you know. I prayed that God would send me a neighbor that loved to sew and quilt. And so God sent her here, but now she forgot that she's here for me. <laughs> Terry's going to hear that. No, she isn't. She doesn't have time to watch my videos. I promise you. Okay, so I have all these quilts going. Yes, I want to make clothes again. Yes, I need clothes again. I truly do need some new tops. My tops are peeling, and I'm not going to shave them. I'm going to give them away or throw them away and make a bunch of new tops with my bunch of fabrics that are in there in my stash. So my friends, hope you're having a lot of fun getting ready for Christmas. Hope you are having a wonderful Christmas celebration with your loved ones. Uh, looks like Jerry and I will be here loving each other, which is fine. <laughs> Thank God we have each other. Some people don't even have another, do they? So, going to let you go for now. Just wanted to say hi. This is what I'm working on right now. And I'm going to be all better really soon. Love you. I'll be back when I get back.